Hey guys, Doug and Travis here from the Sound Fear Pro Audio team. And today we're really excited to finally be doing a shootout series on drum overheads. Today we're gonna be starting out with three different types of microphones, you know, things really typical to see in drum overheads. We've got a large diaphragm condenser with the U87, we have a small diaphragm condenser with the uh, Neumann KM184, and then we have a ribbon mic with the Coles 4038. Generally with small diaphragm condensers, they're gonna be the most detailed and the tightest of the bunch. Um, large diaphragms, you know, being a condenser, you're still going to have a good amount of detail. However, you're going to get a slightly bigger image of the kit and a little bit of smoothness coming in. And of course, ribbons being the most different out of this group, um, typically, you know, it's going to be darker or a little richer. Chances are you're going to have to add just a little bit, if not a good amount of top end EQ back into it just to open things up a little bit. These are just real typical examples for these styles of microphones. They all sound a little bit different. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get started with it, and then we'll start talking about the microphone some more. Next, we're going to listen to the drum overheads with context. You're going to get to hear the tom, the snare, the rack tom, and the kick drum, where we're using the Shure Beta 181s on uh, the smaller drums, and then on the kick drum, we got a Beta 52. So what you should be listening for with this is you're going to hear some differences between the different styles of microphones. So as you'll notice, there are actually four examples here, despite there being only three microphones. Um, and the reason for that is we've included a fourth example, which is the 4038, but with a high frequency EQ added into it using just a basic plugin. The real good point with uh, ribbons and adding this EQ in is ribbons tend to take EQ very well. So you can even be really aggressive, even more aggressive than we've been, if you really wanna bring a lot more shimmer and sizzle out of the top end of your microphones, really get those overheads really, yeah. really bright in the top end. So. Again, when you're listening to these, just remember we did add EQ on one of the ribbon examples.
So we hope you enjoyed. Thanks for checking this out, guys. Definitely stay tuned as we're going to be doing a more detailed comparison within each class. You know, large diaphragms, small diaphragms, and ribbons. So definitely stay tuned to check those out and hear how they'll sound. A lot of these mics are going to be for try before you buy with these videos coming up with the ribbons, the small diaphragm, and the large diaphragm condensers that are following. A lot of those mics are on try before you buy. I know you guys are going to have questions about how they might sound in your room, how they'll sound in your setup. Don't hesitate. Give us a call. Shoot us an email. Let us help take care of you. And thanks for tuning in.